Hey everybody and welcome to this step-by-step -step tutorial on how to install GitHub Desktop on Windows 11. Whether you're a seasoned developer or just getting started with your version control journey, GitHub Desktop can help you manage your repositories with ease. In this video, we'll walk through the entire installation process, so let's dive in. The first step is to download GitHub Desktop. So open up your web browser and type desktop.github.com into your browser's address bar and press enter. When the website loads, click on the Download for Windows button to start the download. Your download should automatically start. Now that we have the installation file, let's proceed with the installation. So locate the downloaded file, which should be in your downloads folder or wherever you chose to save it. Double click on the installer to run it. This will launch the GitHub desktop installation wizard. The process may take a minute or two to install, so just hang tight. Once the installation is complete, you'll see the GitHub desktop welcome screen. Now, if you already have a GitHub account, you can sign in. If not, you can create one by clicking the sign up for GitHub link. I'm going to sign in with my existing account. So I click on sign in to github.com and it takes me to the GitHub login screen where I can enter my username and password. I also have two form factor authentication turned on my GitHub account, so I need to enter a code as well. Once authenticated, you'll see a pop-up box saying your browser is trying to open up an application. Click on open. Great, we're almost there. After signing in, you'll be presented with the GitHub desktop main window. Here you can configure your name and email address, which will be associated with your commits. Click on continue. One thing to check is that GitHub Desktop is integrated and associated with your favourite code editor and shell tool. To do that, click on File and then Options. Now select Integrations. GitHub Desktop has already selected my external editor as Visual Studio Code, which is what I want it to be, but I'm going to change my shell prompt to the Windows Terminal and click Save. Congratulations, you've successfully installed GitHub Desktop on Windows 11. Now you're ready to start managing your repositories with ease. If you're new to Git and GitHub, be sure to check out the documentation and tutorials to get started. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you found it useful, please do hit that thumbs up button and think about subscribing to the channel and even hitting that notification button so as you get notifications of future videos. If you have any problems or any comments or questions, please do and post them inside the comments box below and I'll catch you in the next video folks. Happy coding!